Here's a trick I like to do with Xbox when I want to get a little bit more power and polish to the overall vocal tone. First, I'm going to grab all of our background vocal groups, ad libs, and lead vocals. So this is effectively grabbing all of our vocal tracks. Then we're going to send these to a new bus, and we'll call this our all Vox bus. Then I'll load up Xbox on this track. So now since I'm processing all of the vocals together, I can make some subtle moves to just add a little bit of power and body to these vocals. First, I'm gonna turn off the space and SFX, and I'll start with just applying a little bit of dynamics. So the 2 plus FET is great for this because it adds a nice amount of glue and warmth and analog vibe. Let's move over to the tone module. Again, Vintage is great for adding warmth and color and vibe. So let's listen before and after Xbox on our all Vox group. So at this point, we're just adding a little bit of polish and final touch to these vocals with Xbox on the all Vox group. Now, if I was trying to drastically change the vocal mix, I would go back to the individual tracks. It's always best to start there and get it as close as possible. But sometimes adding a little bit of bus processing like this to the overall vocals is a great way to just push it in the right direction at the final stages of your mix. At this point in the mix, I'll also look for ways to get a little bit creative and add a little bit more interest. So for example, we've got these vocals that happen in the intro. I'm hearing kind of a cool reverb effect here, so I'll switch over to the Infiniverb, boost it up significantly. And now I want to add just a standard channel EQ to this track. I'm going to roll off the highs. And I'll even roll off some of the lows. I'm gonna do something similar on this ad lib intro track. Also wanna add some reverb there. So I like what that rolling off on the highs and lows is doing, but I wanna get even more crisp clarity out of these vocals. So I'm gonna switch over to the telephone mode and turn that up on the SFX. I really like what that's doing on the intro, but we also have this ad lib three, which appears to only be happening there, swelling into the verse. So I'm gonna tap on that one, and I'm also going to apply some significant reverb and processing on that track. So by doing the telephone effect, Infiniverb, adding a little delay, this is just making that swell a little bit more exciting as we get into the verse. You make me want it. So now let's listen before and after all of our Xbox processing. We're just gonna select all the tracks with Xbox on it, and we'll turn it on and off to hear the difference. Baby, what you wanna do? I love where that's sitting for the vocal mix. Now we're gonna move on to mixing the rest of the track and setting up our mix bus processing.